Data privacy and security is a big concern. Um, a lot of manufacturers might be concerned that if other similar manufacturers understand a little bit about their process, they, have, they lose their competitive edge. And, so, and they do also want to feel that they own their, their data. And that's fine. I think we're not trying to own the data itself. What we do do, though, is we look at how that data statistically, through machine learning, through expert systems, can be analyzed and used to predict future events. So whether it's failures, whether it's faults, whatever it may be. And by putting that into the cloud and sharing that across a number of organizations, each customer gets the benefit of a much broader base um, of monitoring. So the data doesn't get shared, but a derivative of the data does get used to provide value across everyone. And that can also be useful in providing some sort of aggregated benchmarking. You know, so my machine's failing more often than the average is, or less often. You know, can I improve my production capability by being better than the average of, of everyone who's been monitored? So that's some of the benefits of having the data in the cloud, is benefiting across a large number of organizations that are monitoring similar things, or even very different things, but have a very similar makeup. The data itself doesn't need to be shared. And so that data, what, what we do do is over time, we reduce the granularity of the data. So initially, we might have samples every minute or even more of a particular equipment that we're monitoring. We don't need that resolution of data in, into the past. So after three months, we'll reduce that resolution of the data after another six again, after a year. So eventually, there's less and less of that data at that resolution that's actually stored. And that also makes it more efficient for storage. Because again, the models, it's the statistical models and the analytics that are more important than the actual historic data. So over time, the data becomes less and less significant, and then it can actually be cleared out of the system.